At the office of the Fresno County Superintendent of Schools, we are proud to bring you Education Matters in partnership with EECU, Table Mountain Rancheria, Fresno State, and KC24. Thank you for watching positive stories about education. Imagine being given only four hours to complete a piece of artwork. Local students participating in the annual Heartbeat event took on that challenge. In tonight's Education Matters, Juanita Stevenson joins us with how this event is a test of students' skills. Juanita. Well, Heartbeat is designed to showcase the art of local students. What's become the highlight of the event has students participating in a Top Chef kind of competition and the public gets a front row seat. People walking past the Cajual Art Gallery in downtown Fresno stop to look through the windows, taking place right before them, a live art project. Yep, one for team, one for team. It started with students from Kerman, Central High, Bullard, and Crescent View Charter School selecting an envelope. Inside, lyrics from a song about peace. Their task is to then take that text, those lyrics, and also translate the music into a visual art piece. And some of the songs, like Peter, Paul, and Mary's If I Had a Hammer, and Bob Marley's Fussing and Fighting was unfamiliar to these students. I don't know, I, my mind was blank. I, I was just like, oh darn. But after listening to the lyrics, students Jasmine Barcoma and Mallory Bandy from Kerman High began to see a vision for the artwork they would create. How we interpreted it was that we, right now, um, in the world we should be loving and caring about each other, but that's not what's happening in the world. Despite that, there's a lot of brutality and violence. They created a profile of a person, and on the inside, all things peaceful and right. On the outside, a representation of violence and world hunger. The paper cranes, their wish. That is my and um, my friend Mallory's wish for the future, um, that it'll one become peaceful. This project is about teamwork students putting into practice the skill of collaboration. Because they're working in teams, they've got to be able to communicate clearly with one another um, and come up with a shared vision. So they've got to sometimes, they've got to vie for their ideas and, and really put their, their ideas out there and be willing to listen to the critique and feedback and the other ideas from their partner. Students had only four hours to complete their paintings, and they will tell you it was a challenging test of their skills. It was a stressful experience at first, but once we got the hang of what we're doing, we got our sketch laid out and we're ready to paint, I think that we really, we gained confidence and we knew what we're doing. Creating artwork live was only part of this event called Heartbeat. On the walls of this gallery hung artwork from students from around the valley, representing months of hard work. The truth is, when we talk about art in terms of talent, we're really selling the artist short because these students have put a lot of time and energy into developing their skills as artists. Now, people have the opportunity to buy the students' art, and all the money raised goes back into art education programs. And Fantastic. it's amazing how each piece was so different. Yeah. Everything was different. And that is just one of the... I love watching that event. Yeah. Yeah. It's in its second year, so That's it's, fantastic. it's neat. Good thing for those little handy things we call phones so they can look up Peter, Paul, and Mary, too, <laughs> oh, right? I know. They yeah. <laughs> yeah. Didn't know who that was. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Thank you, Juanita.